rejected by men and picked by God. Wow, what a story. Do you remember the story of David when Prophet Samuel was sent to anoint David? Even David's father did not believe David could ever become anything. So upon Samuel's arrival, David was sent to take care of flocks, leaving behind his seven beautiful, amazing, handsome, tall, fair, fair brothers. Prophet Samuel came and said, Woo, this guy, you are cute. He must be the one. He was tall in stature. He was handsome. And Prophet Samuel was like, Woo, this is the one. The God said, Samuel, look not at his appearance for I care not about his eyes I care not about how he looks like I care not about what he's made of I don't care next the next one came Samuel was like, okay definitely this one God said no mm -mm. next no next no next no next no Jesse was like what <laughs> Samuel is the one then asking, is this all you have? Like after he presented all his children, he did not even care to say, oh, I have another one in the bush taking care of flocks. He didn't even remember David. He didn't even, he didn't, he didn't even, he didn't even think about David. It is Samuel now saying, oh, do you have another one left? Say, oh yeah, I have another one. There is this boy, he's not good at all. Like, he, he's ugly. He's not very tall and all that. He's taking care of flocks. I don't care you use him. I mean, like, why should God want to use him? So send for him. Get him here, right here, right now. They call David. And the Lord whispered to Samuel, This is he. Rejected by man. And picked by God. Maybe that is you. That is you, right? You've been rejected. When you go to the right, they reject you. Go to the left, they reject you. Try to push forward, they reject you. Nobody wants you around. Nobody wants to invite you to nothing. No one wants to include you. You feel alone. You feel rejected. Today is your reminder. Rejected by man, handpicked by God. Man rejection of you does not change what God has for you. In due season, at the right time, God will open you up to the right people. God bless you.